We are going under the water to find some treasure! The ship has sunken somewhere there and we need to find it. Now we're in the half past and Slav is not here. Probably he's running out of oxygen. Hello my dear viewers and my favorite subscribers! My name is Slav and here is Danny and what's up? Why did you call me? Uh, I mean, we are here today uh, at this water body. I don't know how to call it. Is it a river or a lake or whatever? Sea? Sea, yeah, maybe. Uh, so, the point is, why are we here? Is that I've heard a story about how the the ship has sunken somewhere there. Yeah, yeah, I also heard that. Yeah, that, that's but a it's very not, popular it's, story. But like, it's not an ordinary ship. Wow. Because there were some treasures hidden inside of it. You want to say that there were treasures? Gold. Gold, the thing that you are looking for most of the time. One second. We are talking about treasure hunting and especially underwater treasure hunting. I'm always ready. That's my diving suit. Like I brought do, my do, do, do you usually carry it in your car like on a daily basis or what? Yeah, why not? The car why? Like what for? No, okay, that's whatever. That's whatever. That's yeah, actually Yeah, that's not your deal, my uh, friend. Well, yeah, that's 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 better that you ha have it. Yeah, yeah. You all you have to be ready for everything always. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's good. So, correct. tell me the story where this ship could be. I mean, I do not know the exact location, but it's probably somewhere in the middle. In the middle of this water body, because, well, in the middle, the depth is the lowest. Yeah, yeah, say. yeah, I and see. Only there, the ship could be sunken, possibly, because apart from that, no. Yeah, it's somewhere in the middle. Okay, give me a few seconds, I will gear up, and let's see okay. what's hidden there under water. Here we are, are almost ready, are almost geared up to start our new adventure, but I want to show you my my favorite new underwater gadget, which will also help us in this journey. That is a Sea Cool D2. What's that? Basically, it's this underwater thrusters. It's like shorts that you can put on yourself and you will have thrusters under the water. So it's like turbines, mini yeah. turbines. Yeah, oh. you're gonna have them here and you can use it to dive with a high speed. Cool. Okay, let me gear up completely and I will show you how it works. Okay. That is my best underwater gadget. I'm really enjoying swimming with it and you can also have one and learn more information about Seacool D2 and other Seacool gadgets by the link in my description. It looks like I'm going to space, not under the water. But anyway, let's try how that thing works. Oh my God, I feel myself like a Superman. Wow, <laughs> that's cool. I'm gonna be very relaxed during this adventure because I'm not gonna do anything to swim. I don't need to move my legs, I don't need to move my arm. Thrusters are doing all for me. Okay, Danny, I'm ready to go down. All right. See you soon. I hope so. And so finally, Slav is on his adventure right now. But, you know, he didn't really expect what he will see there. And one more important thing uh, to remind you is that Slav doesn't know the location of that ship. And uh, the first part of his journey is to find it actually and to uh, get there safe, you know. And actually do you know this place is a natural reserve so it is highly guarded with uh, special forces in order to not break anything here and underwater there are some beautiful coral reefs and I hope that Slav doesn't break anything there I mean first of all the coral reefs second of all his bones uh, 
I don't want him to break anything there because we will get in trouble. Moreover, not only coral reefs, but also there are some beautiful fish on the water and I hope that Slav, I hope that he won't try to catch it with his, with his hands because, well, he will not succeed and probably he will damage the fish. So yeah, and I hope that he doesn't forget to monitor the gas level, the oxygen, I mean, because its amount is limited. As far as I know, near that sunken ship, there is the most beautiful coral reef in the entire world. I don't know if it's true or not, but I've heard the stories about a beautiful sea turtle that lives right next to that coral reef. And the possibility of meeting that sea turtle is like one to 100,000. So it's a very rare occasion. Well, however, Slav always tells that he's very, very lucky. I do not really think that he's about to be that lucky to meet that sea turtle. And well, this makes me wonder if Slav is actually able to find that sunken ship. Because, well, he's away for quite a long time and the coral reef itself is very huge. So it will take, I don't know, an hour to explore maybe. But if he actually gets the chance to find that sunken ship. Well, I could only imagine his emotions. And after that, I could only imagine the way that we may probably sell something that he's about to find. Who knows? I wouldn't actually explore the ship's hold because it's very dangerous there and who knows what kind of creatures live there. Well, this ship has been underwater for so long that many marine species, many uh, types of marine life have made their homes there. And as far as I know, that ship is a cargo ship. So it was used to transport some, well, cargoes from point A to point B. And that ship is pretty old. So it's been lying there for around 50 years. I don't know. It was used to transport the construction materials. So probably Slav will find something which is connected with that kind of thing there. jokes aside, I hope that Slav will take this uh, expedition very, very seriously. <laughs> and sometimes you probably have to observe the uh, wildlife uh, of that water body so that probably some fish or something else will show you the place where something lies. Slav has to be very very attentive because probably he doesn't know but you'd probably look for something that looks like a box because in the boxes there probably is something. actually getting late for him to 
get out of the water because probably he's running out of oxygen. So I hope that soon enough he will come back. Uh, I'm actually getting quite nervous because like an hour and a half have passed and Slav is not here. We are pretty worried here. Oh, I see the bubbles though. Okay. Hello. Okay. Ooh, thank I God. It. Thank God he's I alive. Found it. What did you find? I found the sunken ship and I found some kind of a box. Oh, Stupid God. fish was fighting against me, but look, that might be something incredible. Thanks for the splashes though. Uh, I really love these thrusters. These are amazing guys. It works just, properly. Huh? Does it work properly? It, I have to do nothing. I just, just have to uh, put my arms in front of me and swing automatically. It's wow. impossible to do with the simple fins. But now I don't need oh, yeah. fins. Oh all. yeah, 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 you don't need that. Well, what was that box? I have no idea. I need some tools to open it up and let's see what's inside. No! Oh, that's it. It was the of great that historical was value. Come on. <gasps> no way. No, is that? It is looks that? like a golden bar. Wow. And the coins, and the coins, they're, they're also they kind golden of golden. What? Yeah, kind of. And most importantly oh my gosh we are rich right now oh we yeah are rich <laughs> but you know this is pretty funny yeah but this bottle now uh, i think that's is that whoa what the heck is it is it a rum that is rum oh that is rum cool. no hey leave something for me <sighs> ah no but I just, I just, I just understood that this thing can be worth like two thousand dollars at least, and he drunk half of it. Stand up. <sighs> Drunky. Okay, I guess I may try it as well. Jeez. Ah. Yeah, okay, that's that's some good stuff. I'll just leave it here. I need to put him up. Stand up! Uh, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Fucking finish that later. Yeah, we found some valuables here and I hope we'll get something from it. And yeah, thank you very much. It was Slav's Adventures channel. That's me, Danny, and that's this drunky Slav. So see ya in our videos. And yeah, we probably need to get him out of the water.